Hello everyone, Smackalicious here. Today I'm cooking my first turkey. I'm going to show you how I thawed it, how I cleaned it, how I seasoned it, and how I cooked it. So come on, let's get started. Okay, I have my turkey in a bin and I followed the uh, directions that Butterball gave you how to thaw the turkey. So I have two bins with water in them. In each bin, I will place the turkey back and forth every 30 minutes. So every 30 minutes, I'll change it and put it in the other bin. Okay, my turkey is thawed. Now I'm get, gonna begin to clean it. I'm gonna rinse it off real good before I start cleaning it. Make sure you use cold water when rinsing it off. So here, this is where I'm showing you how I clean my turkey. So now I need to get inside the bird. So what I do is I release the legs from up under the skin. Then I remove all of the innards. Um, that right there is the turkey butt. Here, I'm just cutting away some fat. Now, I'm going inside and removing the turkey neck. Then right here, I'm just trimming away some turkey skin. Okay, don't forget to take out the back with the giblets in it. You don't want to leave that in there while you're cooking it. Okay guys, so here's the fun part. You have to clean your bird really well. Make sure you pull all that fat and all that discolored membrane. Clean all that out really well. You wanna clean your bird really good before you cook it. You wanna get inside that cavity real good and pull out all of those innards. You want to make sure you check the neck area. You want to cut away all unwanted skin and all that um, discoloration. So here I'm just cleaning it, cleaning my turkey some more, just making sure that it's clean really well. This is all the fat and all the skin that I cut off my turkey. So I'm going to discard that in the trash. So here I have my turkey neck and my turkey butt and giblets and I'm just going to set that to the side. This is what I'm using for my marinade to inject my turkey. In a bowl, I have melted the country crock spread and uh, I'm adding the white pepper. Cajun seasoning. complete
garlic salt. onion powder and Italian seasonings Okay, now you want to mix all your seasonings in well with the country crock. This is just the same seasonings that I use for my marinade. So what I'm doing now is sprinkling all those seasonings inside of the turkey. So here, this is where I'm tressing the turkey. I'm gonna take the wing and tuck it up under the breast. And here, I'm taking the legs and putting it back under the skin of the turkey. Okay, so here I have red and green bell peppers, onions, celery, and garlic. I put that inside of the turkey to help with more seasoning and flavor. Okay, this is what I'm using to inject my turkey. Okay, so here I'm taking the needle off to get some of that marinade inside the syringe. Okay, so now you want to inject your turkey with marinade. Now push the marinade in slowly. You don't want to do it too fast because it'll squirt back out. You can see right here when I'm injecting it, it starts to swell. So I'm just going to continue to inject the turkey with marinade, making sure that when I inject it, that the area swells. Okay, now my bird is um, injected with all of the marinade, and you can see that it has gotten a little bigger. Okay, so I buttered my turkey down, and now I'm just sprinkling over some Cajun seasoning on top. Okay, 
I'm going to place some aluminum foil over it and I'm going to put it in a 325 degree oven and let it cook for three and a half hours. So what you think? I did a good job, didn't I? I hope you enjoyed the video. And please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. And please have a smackalicious day.